Hey guys, and welcome back to my real life car builds in GTA 5. In this episode, we're going to be looking at the Weenie Issy, and we're going to be turning that into the Mini Cooper. And not just any Mini Cooper, we're going to be doing the JCW, or the John Cooper Works. And this was suggested by Harbev, so thanks for sending that in, buddy. I was actually fortunate enough to drive the first JCW that arrived in Australia back in, I think it might have been like 2006 or 2007. My brother-in-law had a friend who was part of the motoring press and he did test drives of the car and I managed to pick it up. So I got to drive this thing around Sydney for a little bit and it was an absolute blast. I think 2005 was the first year that you could buy the Cooper Works direct from the factory. But here in Australia, I think we only got them in 2006 or in 2007. The Works version had a few significant changes over the regular Mini Cooper S. It has 210 horsepower, it has a different supercharger, and it has a different suspension and exhaust layout from what I understand. It will do 0 to 100 or 0 to 62 miles per hour in 6.5 seconds, which is not as fast as some of the hyper cars, I'll admit, but it's pretty fast when you're sitting in a car of that size. Anyway, once you've got your hands on an Issy, we're going to roll it into Los Santos Customs. Now for this build, I'm going to try and emulate the appearance of the real Mini Cooper Works that I drove back in the day. So we're going to go with a white and black colour scheme. So under the bumpers, for the front bumper, we're going to go for the custom front splitter. And for the rear, we're going to go for the custom rear bumper. For the exhaust, I've just left this stock. There's nothing that really matches the real life car, so this is totally up to personal preference. For the hood, we're going to stick the vented hood on. Now, for the primary colour, I've gone for Ice White, which is under Classic. And for the secondary colour, I've gone for Graphite, which is also under Classic. There's some custom skirts under skirts that we're going to stick on. For the wheel type, I've gone with the Venom, which are listed under Sport. But I think the Loz Speed 10 are also a good choice. For the wheel colour, we're going to go black. And we're going to stick on the wheel accessories. We're going to go for the custom tyres. For the window tint, I've gone for Limo, and that will make the whole top of the car look like a solid black colour. And as usual, we're going to slam the suspension and max out all the other performance upgrades. Now admittedly, even when this car is completely pimped out to the max, it's not all that quick. But it does turn on a dime and it is a lot of fun to drive around in. And I think it looks pretty sweet as well. Anyway, as usual, I've stuck all my customization options in the description field so you can go ahead and build your own JCW. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I want to thank you for watching and I'll catch you later. Now this was suggested by Have Bear. I hope I got that name right. So thanks for sending. It. And this was sent in by Harbev. So and this was sent in by Harbev. So thanks for sending that in. And this was sent in by Harbev. So thanks for sending that in. And this was suggested by Harbev. So send. And this was suggested by Harbev. So send.